This has potential here to be a personal best. Snaps for me. Snaps for me. Uh, what? I tied it. I tied my personal best. Ah! Uh, kill 405. I got a jar of swamp. I've never... <laughs> Why did so much stuff drop? I feel like 12 items just dropped. What is this? Uh, I've never had a jar drop before. <laughs> uh, by the way, today's the same day that I got the ranger boots. I've just been at work all day. And, uh, yeah, now I get a jar of swamp. <laughs> I don't have the little display case built, but maybe I will. Maybe I will now. It's so random. I've never built one of these things before. Let's do it. Oh, look at all that XP. So what, do I just... Oh! Oh, it don't open it. I just place it in it? Oh! Oh, that is sick. I almost want to, like, flip the room around so I can see it when I come in. I'm gonna do that. <laughs> Now I can come hang out at Zolra and flap like a chicken whenever I want. Cobra, 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 chameleon. You come and go. You come and go. Whoa, whoa. Living would be easy if your colors were like my dream. Red, blue, and green. Red, blue, and green. No way, man. I have not gotten a duplicate at Zolra. This is the second kill this morning. It's like 7.20. I don't know why I got to tell you the time, man. This is my second kill this morning. I have not gotten a duplicate at Zolra, and now I get the Magic Fang. I have all of the Zolra drops minus the mutagens and the pet. Oh, my God. I don't believe it, man. No duplicates. Charge it. Boom. Uh, oh, boy. What do I, how do I, I think I need scales and stuff. Yeah, I got to keep doing Zolra, though, for the scales, man. What the yes. So it's the trident with a fang. Let's go. Wasn't even paying that close of attention, and I got a new personal best by, like, two seconds. I'll take it. Okay, well, I'm going to need a lot more fossils to get the full XP. It's like 120k XP for doing all of them, so yeah, this is a pretty pitiful amount that I've completed here. Yeah, hardly any of it, but cool. I feel like I know what to do now when I get them. I'm a little less clueless, a little more clued in. Well, I didn't record it like a silly boy, but my real-life friend... Lemon here. I have a video of him getting 99 Smith, and he's been my friend since we were little kids. And uh, yeah, he's training strength. And I gave him the Abyssal Dagger I got at Sire recently. He, you know, he doesn't have a ton of money in the game. So yeah, I mean, I'm not going to use it. Hell yeah, dude. Looks good on. Looks good on you, Lemon. Looks good on you. Awesome. I have 16 crystal keys. I'm going to get all these dragon stones and at the very least put together what I need for the last jewelry box, but maybe some extra stuff just that I want. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at those XP drops, man. Look at those XP drops. So I went and charged my rings at the Fountain of Rune and I made plenty of extra skills necklaces. I don't need a I don't really want to keep combat bracelets in the bank, but this will be for the jewelry box. I don't feel like getting the boost at the moment, but I have all the stuff for it. And look at this. 66 amulets of glory. It seems like a lot to me. Um yeah. So <laughs> I'll just use them willy nilly. This is kind of random, but I want to buy a little stockpile of proselyte for when I do wilderness slayer again. I've actually never lost any of my proselyte armor, but I just feel like it's something I should I should do. <laughs>
This is the first Kraken task since I had the trident of the swamp. So I'm going to do my best to make this as long a trip as possible. I could have brought one more food, I guess, but hopefully I get some lucky food drops. I'm going to, you know, be a good boy and juggle everything. And I think my record was like 48, I think. So let's do more than that. And yeah, I'm wearing full carols and yeah, we got we got we got our defenses rolling here, boy. Boy. 60 kills, boy. 60 kills. Holy crap, that was a 1.4 mil trip. New personal best here, 154. I think by I want to say 8 seconds. Cool. I missed her there, but that is 97 defense. Looking good. Looking good. 2010 total. I skipped a couple tasks that I didn't feel like doing, but I've been sticking with it, trying not to skip very much at all, and starting to get a little pile of points here, 650, 650 points, and 650 tasks completed. This is Sire Kill Count 100 coming in. Oh yeah, we're getting specs today, son. My highest spec so far is a 78, is actually on Sire as well, so that, that was pretty cool. Well, we faced him real fast. We faced him real quick. A lot of the time, seems like a lot of the time you don't even have to uh, bl blood barrage if you, you know, get big enough hits. I'm just going to ride this one out. Yep. Sure enough. Nice earth orbs. Kill count 100. Awesome. Got around 120 sire kill count. Still plenty left on that task. I need to break it up some by doing some barrows. I haven't been here with the uh, trident or ranger boots, so gonna enjoy this a little bit. I do think we're about due for an item. Nope. We have kill count 200 coming in. It's this will make 158 kills without an unsired. So, I just hit the, you know, effectively the drop rate for the two unsireds that I do have, but 158 dry. Look at that. Honest Bolt Tips, great drop for such a pretty kill count. After 181 kills since my last unsired, there we have it. Alright, I'm stoked, man. I'm stoked as a pony. Ooh. I'm going to go ahead and finish the rest of the task here at Sire. Only less than 30 left. So I've done over 150. It was a pretty big task that I had, so I'm looking forward to it. But for now, let's see what this unsired nets us. Oh, we got our second bludgeon piece. Cool. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome, man. Okay, so it's only been a couple kills since the last unsired I got, and I was saying, you know, I'm just going to close out these last 30 here. In, back, in the back of my head, I was thinking, you know, I went 180 without getting one, you know, oh man, I totally could get a second one at, uh, before the end of this task, and sure enough, baby, sure enough. <laughs> Are we going to finish the bludgeon? Are we going to get a abyssal head? What are we going to get? Oh, jar of miasma. <laughs> uh, awesome. <laughs> All right, well, so I went from not having any uh, display thing here to now I got two. I think I do like the Zelra one more because Zelra's a badass, but that's pretty cool too. I'm happy with it. Yeah, that was kill count 223 I got one and 226. <laughs> Three apart, that's crazy, man. Finishing up this Abyssal Demon task here, just two kills left. This one here will be kill count 250. Pretty happy about it. I got uh, I got two unsireds this task. That is just amazing. Oh, nice. Yep, kill count 250. Moving on. Coming in with 97 Slayer. Oh, man. I got three skills that are level 97 right now. That is something else. I'm pretty close to a few 99s. I can dig it. Need some tabs? I have like 10 left. I don't want to revert all my other, you know, my special tabs. So I went and made some more, baby. Made a few more. Well, man, I got a good feeling about this one. What do I... I'm telling you, I got a good feeling about it.
Uh, uh. All right, here we go. Got a Carol's leather top. It is a duplicate, but that is such a great item. I have no problem with having another one of those. I think that's back-to-back -back Carol's leather top with Aram's hood. What the heck? <laughs> Ooh -wee. KC261, this is my, okay, I gotta count them again. Two bludgeon pieces, miasma, and the dagger. Okay, this is my fifth one. Fifth unsired. Oh man, I'm so excited. Oh, I'm so tickled right now. I'm just so tickled right now. How do we do? How do we do? Oh, another abyssal dagger. <laughs> Oh, that's, so, that's so cool. I I think earlier in the same video, I gave an abyssal dagger to my real life friend because I got it here. Oh, that's so funny. Oh, that's awesome. That's so awesome. Yo, this shit is so hot. It is so hot, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> well, the servers were straight doggy doo doo today. I finished that abyssal task over at. You know, just the normal demons. Oh, 15 steel, that won't take but a minute. But, finished them over at normal demons. I got 10 and sold abyssal heads. I was like, dang, that's a lot of heads. Dang, man, that really snuck up on me. I I was not expecting that at all, man. I got 98 defense. Woo! Oh, man, getting real close to max melee. I like it. I like it a lot. I am planning on... Probably just sticking to Slayer and maybe some, maybe some Nightmare Zone, but probably just Slayer to get 99 defense and ranged. Also, I'm mixing in Barrows here and there. I still need a tank chest piece, and I only have one complete set, which is Carol's. I'm really struggling for Barrows gear. Keeping it chill. How do we do? Ooh, 20 Torstal. I don't really use those yet, but that's... Seems like a decent drop. What is it worth? Oh, alright. It's a special day. It's a special day. 666 tasks complete. Yeah! Last time I did Smoke Devil, I did the redemption setup where I just used a bunch of prayer potions and no food. I'm going to try it this way this time. Honestly, it's been a very long time since I've done this. After I got the occult necklace, I just decided I didn't really want to do it anymore. Don't have a great reason for it. He's really easy. I'm going to see how this goes by using food on him, though. Should be, should be pretty legit. Snagging 500 kill count over here at Thermo. I've gotten one occult necklace, quite a few ancient staffs. No smoke battle staffs, though. But this sure will be a shiny, shiny number if I, you know, hit him sometime. Good lord. Good god. I'm trying out just going to my house after uh, every few kills. And so I don't use food. It's working out. KC292. I believe this is my sixth. Sixth. Unsired. Let's go, baby! Yes! Let's go! Give me that axon. Give me that... Oh, another jar of my asthma. <laughs> oh, I wanted the other thing so bad. So bad. <laughs> Alrighty. My audio got scuffed, but at 375, so about like 90 kills later, or 80-something kills later, I got my seventh unsired. So... I went ahead and plopped her over by the little font over here, and I got something very special happy. I was a very happy boy. You can't hear me screaming. It's probably a good thing, in all honesty, but... So I just go ship over and skip all the dialogue frantically and get this beautiful thing made. So I still need to finish 99 defense. I'm, like, halfway through 98. Um, but after that, I'll be using that bludgeon for cal fight and when I want to melee Cerberus. I will still be just doing ranged at Cerberus for 
a bit because I'm almost 99 ranged as well. It's like 97 and a quarter, 97 and a half, something like that. I have no idea what that little book does. I'm not going to ask questions though. So I'm super happy about that. I decided since this is just like a strength only weapon, I can afford to use some of my chaos runes to get the obsidian chest and legs. I'm so used to just using the proselyte, but I was thinking, you know what, may as well may as well suit up with as much strength as possible. I'm not sure when I'll be going to God Wars to really grind Bandos. So until then I'll just try this out. It will be a little weird not having all the prayer bonus I'm used to using, but really shouldn't make too big of a difference and I'm gonna keep trying to practice my one tick flicking. So I feel like a stud now wearing this stuff. I look a little bit more fearsome. I'll look a lot better when I can actually use the bludgeon after I'm done training defense. Good lord. I'm so ready to be done training defense. But now that I got that out of the way, I'm, I can go back to killing the normal abyssal demons and getting some pretty decent XP rates. So thank you so much for bearing with me. It took me a lot longer to get this episode out than the previous ones. Just played a little bit less and really just wanted to make sure I had quality stuff for you guys despite playing a little less. So thanks a lot for joining me, guys. Have fun scaping.